All ten witnesses against you withdrew their statements last night. All at once, nine o'clock. Don't ask me why, because I don't know. The next ten minutes, you don't do or say anything I haven't told you. All right? All right? Yeah. Hello, Ollie. Wait, hang on. Just you, yeah? He stays out here. You stay here. The light, the horizon tries, but it's just not as kind on the eyes. Is that a Get me out of there. I need to get you to a telephone. You need to make a call. It's all part of Tommy's plan. Apparently. That will probably be for you, won't it? Hello? Arthur, your aunt. Right, so that'll be your side of the street swept up, won't it? Where's mine? What you got for me? Signed by the Minister of the Empire himself? Yeah. Yeah. This means that you can put your rum in our shipments and no one at Poplar Docks will lift a canvas. You know what? I'm not even going to have my lawyer look at that. No, no, it's all legal. You know what? Mate, I trust you. That's that. Done. So, whiskey. There is uh, one thing, though, uh, that we do need to discuss. What would that be? It says here, 20% pay to me of your export business. As we agreed on the telephone. No, 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 no. See, I've had my lawyer <coughs> draw this up for us, just in case. You know, <coughs> it says that yeah, here that a hundred percent of your business goes to me. I see. It's there, right? Don't worry about it, right? Because it's totally legal binding. All you have to do is sign the document and transfer the whole lot over to me. It's not just here, is it? Yeah. I see. That's funny. That is. What? Nah, that's funny. I'll give you 100% of my business. Yeah. Why? Ollie, no, 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 he understands, he understands. He's a big boy, he knows the road. Now, look, it's just non-fucking negotiable. That's all you need to know. So all you have to do is sign a fucking contract. Right there. Just sign it. With your pen. I understand. Good. Get on with it. Well, I have an associate waiting for me at the door. I know he looks like a quiet boy, but he is actually an anarchist. From Kentish Town. Tommy, I'm going to fucking shoot you, right? Now, when I came in here, Mr. Solomons, I stopped to tell my shoelace. Isn't that a fact, Ollie? I stopped to tell my shoelace. <clears throat> and while I was doing it, I laid a hand grenade on one of your barrels, Mark 15, with wire trip. And my friend upstairs, well, he's like one of those anarchists that uh, they blew up Wall Street, you know? He's a professional, and he's in charge of the wire. 
If I don't walk out that door with a stroke of seven, he's going to trigger the grenade and your very combustible rum will blow us all to hell. And I don't care. Because I'm already dead. He tied his legs, Alfie, and there is a kid at the door. From a good family, too. Ollie, it's shocking what they become. What were you doing when he sat there? Oh, he tied his lace, nothing else. Yeah, but what were you doing? I was marking the runners in the paper. What are you doing? Just sick of the time. Carry on. All right, Ollie, I want you to go outside, yeah, and shoot that boy in the face from the good family. All right. Anyone walks through that door except me, he blows the grenade. He tied his fucking lace on it to my lace. I bet, hundred to one, you'll fucking lie in, mate. That's my money. I well, see you failed to consider the form. I did blow up my own pub for the insurance. Okay, right, well, considering the form. I would say 65 to 1, very good odds. And I would be more than happy and agree if you decide over 65% of your business to me. Thank you. 65? No deal. Ollie, what do you say? Jesus Christ, Alfie, he tied his fucking lace, I saw him! Mm. Look, he planted a grenade, I know he did. Alfie, it's Tommy fucking Shelby! <laughs> you were behaving like a fucking child. This is a man's world. Now take your apron off. I see in the corner like a little boy. Fuck off. Now. Four minutes. Right, four minutes. <clears throat> Talk to me about hand grenades. The chalk mark on the barrel, the knee height. It's a Hamilton Christmas. Took out the pin and put it on the wire. Based on this, forty-five percent. Thirty. Oh fuck off, Tommy. That's far too little. In France, Mr. Solomon. So while I was a tunneler, a clay kicker, one seven nine. I blew up Schwabenau. Same kit I'm using today. Funny that. I do know the 179. And I heard they all got buried. Three of us dug ourselves out. Like you're digging yourself out now. Like I'm digging now. <laughs> Listen, I'll give you 35%. That's your lot. Thirty-five. 